Hello friends. It is Friday, April 18th, I think. In this light, my makeup looks really like wow, but I don't think it really is. My lips, I might tone down a little bit. But, um, I don't know. It doesn't look really blended, but I blended the crap out of it. Maybe it's the light. Maybe if I go like this, I don't know. Um, anyway, I use the Too Faced Love Sephora palette. Um, let's see. So, as a base in my crease, I use Behind the Counter as like a transition color. And then on my eyes, so, okay, on my eyes, you can't even really see it here. Um, I use 1998 around in the inner corner of my lid, David and Marge in the middle, and Envy in the outer crease. So those are these colors right here. Um, this light in my house is not cool. I don't know. I'm going to stand where I normally stand. Let me see if I change the white balance. Oh, no. Here's good. See, here doesn't look that bad. I don't know. I never do color on my eyes, and I'm wearing a shirt with, like, this color. So, whatever. Why I brought my perfume down, I'm not sure. But this is the one that I use most often. It's Gucci 2. I freaking love it. It's expensive, but I don't care. It's the best. So, I'm going to get our lunches together. It's basically going to be the exact same as yesterday. Um, I have my soup. Hubby has his... Just kidding, I have a different one. I have the Creole chicken gumbo one. And I think I'm gonna add some spinach to it or bring some spinach to add to it because that, um, I don't know what else would go in gumbo. I don't really wanna put green beans in it. So anyway, I'm gonna get going and I will see you guys a little later. I'm gonna go try and take a selfie and see if it makes my face not look so bright. Okay, I think that's a little bit better. I just kind of blotted off some of that. I'm using the, um, it's another hard candy, all glossed up uh, crayon, but I think the pink is too intense for this look. I'm gonna get it out now and show you which color it is. It's this one, it's called Pout. It's not actually that pink. Like if you look at this, the actual color is darker than what is on like the outside. Um, but I think it's too intense with like, the eyes and everything like that. Um, anyway, I'm back here because I'm just gonna eat this now while I'm waiting for Hubby to come back downstairs. I'm gonna pack everything um, and I will see you guys when I get to work. I'll just, you know, show you snapshots of whatever, um, my coffee and my yogurt, which is what you're gonna see. So, um, and then tonight I will respond to a bunch of the comments from the past couple of days. I know I haven't been doing that, but it's Friday and I don't have anything else to do. So um, maybe you'll get to see hubby too, I don't know. So I will talk to you guys later. Hello kitties. It is gross and rainy outside and thundering and it is not good. Um, my face feels so oily and greasy right now. I've been using the primer that I got in my Ipsy bag, which is a, supposed to be a matte primer, and it's supposed to help, like, acne, which I kind of have a little bit right now. But I don't think it's doing a good job of keeping my face matte. Um, right now, Regularly, I use the Rimmel Stay Matte Primer, and I freaking love it because it keeps my face matte. Um, but I don't know if it's the primer that's not working or something else. I don't know, but um, I'm going to make dinner. I'm going to have the Santa Fe beans and rice because I love it. Like, it's so good. And then Hubby said he was in the mood for pizza, so I'm going to make him pizza. Um... Anyway, I'm going to go make food. I'm going to make some coffee for myself because, I don't know, I've just been feeling like coffee in the evening. And to answer a question from, I forget who asked, but I don't drink decaf ever. Um, but coffee does not keep me up ever. It does not wake me up ever. It's just something that, I, I don't know, I used to drink coffee with dinner and then I stopped. And now I've started again. I don't know if it's because, like, I have, 
I mean, I guess I can give you a little mini tour. Like right here is where my um, coffee station is. I have all my mugs up in here and I really only use these right here. I have my Keurig and my K-Cups in here. Um, that's not sugar, it's called Waylo. It's so much better. I have my kitchen towels in this drawer, but then you go down here and it's like drink station. I've got my soda stream, my milkshake thing, a regular coffee maker. Back there is some coffee and tea and my electric kettle. Um, this is my kitchen area in the backyard and it's raining and a bunch of stuff. I mean, you guys have seen this from pictures maybe. Stove, fridge, microwave, you've seen the inside of the pantry. Um, so that's kind of a, I don't know, but I'm gonna go make stuff, make dinner, and um, I'll be back after dinner. Since you guys have kind of already seen this, I'm gonna spend more time today responding to comments, reading comments, and I don't know what else, just because it's kind of gross outside, and I don't really feel like doing anything else. Um, I don't know what comes on TV tonight. And maybe we'll watch a movie or something. But all right, I'm gonna get going because I need coffee and I need food. Bye. Hey guys, so do my eyebrows look weird? Like not long enough? I've been filling them in, but I haven't been extending them. And I looked at a picture of myself the other day and it's weird. And Lo even said, like, should it go down to here? I'll try it, but it, every time I do it, it just looks weird. I don't know, whatever. They're just eyebrows, right? So I really need to go wash my face because it feels so greasy and oily today. I don't think I'm going to use that primer anymore. Um, that might be the reason for it. I don't even think it's doing anything for my acne except pulling it out of my face. Um, so what I am going to do is go through some of the comments from the vlogs from like the beginning of the week. And I don't know if I'm going to actually like read them all, read them all, but I'll definitely go through some. So I don't think I'm going to do anything with the Nutrisystem vlog comments. I'm just going to start from, was April 15th the first one? I don't know. What day is today? The 18th? I'm like so confused right now. Oh, uh, where's my calendar? Okay, so Monday was the 14th. And so Monday was the first, first day, March 1st, no, that's not right. Uh, maybe there wasn't any comments on that one, so I'll just start with the 15th. Um, sorry you guys, I'm all like, Monday, Monday, Tuesday, okay. So April 15th. According to my email, there's only one. Um, so Jackie says, so proud of you guys for sticking as close as you can to Nutrisystem Foods. It feels so good to get your goal weight, get to your goal weight now. Don't ever go past the two pound gain. Uh, I'm not sure, but I think Nutrisystem Food has more fiber in it than smart ones. Um, it, it kind of does and it kind of doesn't, but the smart ones have a lot of protein in them. Um, We've not been craving anything all week. We've been full. We've been eating all of our meals. Um, and I don't know. Like, if you have a good balance of Nutrisystem food and other food, or like today, for instance, I was um, on the website Skinny Taste, and I was looking up a bunch of recipes that I could make and eat um, for, like, lunch and dinners. There was one that I found called Fiesta Lime Rice, and it sounds so good. It's got rice, black beans, corn, tomatoes, scallions, cilantro, and lime, and that's it. And you just basically mix all that stuff together, and it's like a good meal. You've got the protein from your beans. Um, the nutritional information for that was like fantastic. Really low in calories, not a lot of fat, high in protein, high in fiber. Um, so, and a serving of that is like a cup. So even if you took like 
a half of a pita or something or pita chips, one ounce of pita chips and used it with that, that would be an acceptable lunch or dinner. I would probably eat it for dinner. Um, so that's even really awesome. So the next day, 16th, 16th, okay. Why? Um, what palette did I wear? The chocolate bar palette on April 16th? Is that what I used? Um, I actually won that from Too Faced on Facebook, so that was kind of awesome. Um, Pink Lady says, your dinner looks so good, and I'm sorry for saying this late, uh, so late, but congrats on the new house. I look forward to the house tour in the future. Yeah, I'm totally gonna, um, wait on that, because like I said, we're still getting settled in. And I don't want you guys seeing a messy house because I don't like that. Um, so on the 17th vlog, so yesterday's vlog, Karen says, your hair looks so pretty curled. Random question, but when you drink coffee in the... Okay, so Karen was the one who asked about the decaf coffee. Thank you for loving my curly hair. Um, it takes a lot of work. It takes about 30 minutes. And actually, my I, I really want one of those new me... Um, Titan 3 multi um, barrel styling tools or like the one with the five of them because I think they're longer they're clipless of course my hair gets kind of caught on the clip of my curling irons right now and it kind of sucks when I'm trying to you know release I don't clip my hair I still wrap it around it but it gets stuck like underneath of the clip sometimes like the ends of my hair um, Pads for Buddy, the little noise he makes when you pet him is so adorable. He's such a very sweet dog. Love the lip gloss you were wearing yesterday, so I'm going to hunt it down. Thanks for giving the product info. I want to like lip crayons, but I haven't found one glossy enough. But the one you were wearing looked great. Have a good night. I love lip crayons, no matter what. Um, if you need to add gloss to them, like I just add like a lip balm or something. Um, but... The hard candy all glossed up ones are definitely glossy. I do still have to touch it up though. Um, the color stays, but you know, if I feel like my lips are getting too dry or something, I just, you know, reapply it and it, it feels fine. Um, and then the last comment, is Jackie says, I'm on the shelf stable Nutrisystem food. Do you think it's worth it to upgrade and pay the extra money for the frozen food too? Yes and no. It really depends on what you like. Like the stuffed chicken breasts are so amazing. They are so delicious. They have a chicken and broccoli one or broccoli and cheese chicken one. And then they have a mushroom stuffed one. And the mushroom stuffed one is my favorite. I wasn't a big fan of the broccoli cheese one, but it's still really good. Um, the pizzas are really good. Hubby's favorite was the sausage one. I liked the margarita pizzas and I threw spinach on top and that took my vegetable for the night. Um, some of the other ones like the tilapia with the, um, the rice and the asparagus is really good. Um, I'm trying to decide, oh, the, I think there's like a Salisbury steak one that hubby liked. The turkey and mashed potatoes is really good. Um, but they change it up all the time. So in my opinion, of course, the frozen is going to be much better because it's like fresher, you know, but it's really up to you. If you have room in your freezer, because I think, um, like for our plan, we got 10, 10 dinners, 10 breakfasts, 10 lunches, 10 desserts. Um, like the breakfast stuff, the waffles are really good. Oh my goodness, Buddy's like, I don't know. Um, the French toast is good. The, oh, the muffins, the sausage and egg muffins. And then you add a piece of cheese for your power fuel in the morning. It is so delicious. It's like so good. Um, so yeah, I think that's all the comments really on the vlogs. Uh, let me see if I should just like go to... Okay, so Jackie also said on the day 48, March 1st vlog, um, the energizing shake is bitter and the Craving Crusher shake was yummy, so I agree with Kat, it was nasty. Um, I got the flu and was sick to my stomach during the fast five. I did four days and quit the shakes and just went straight into the Nutrisystem plan. Best decision I made. Sorry, but that sucked. I had done five days from Walmart before, before that 
and then got my box from Nature System and tried to go into the Fast Five, and I, um, and like I said, it was hard. I felt like I was starving, um, but now I'm happy. Two weeks and three days, and I'm down 9.7 pounds. That's fantastic. Um, if I had to do the Fast Five over again, I don't think I would. <laughs> but it was a good transition from eating like crap to getting on the Nutrisystem plan. Um, it kind of helped us realize what proper portions were. Um, so for us, it wasn't too, too bad, honestly. Um, Jackie, are you just now, like... Getting caught up with vlogs, because <laughs> all of my comments are from you. <laughs> um, what else? I think that was really it. Um, I think I've answered everything too, so I am going to just end it right now. Um, for dessert, I think I'm gonna have, well, I have a pudding that I made, or I'll have some pita chips again. I think I'll have some of the pita chips because that's really good. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I don't know if I want the regular ones or the cinnamon sugar ones. Cinnamon sugar ones are really good though. Um, so I hope you guys had a really good Friday. Um, I hope you have a really good weekend. Uh, it looks like the clouds are moving and it's not raining anymore, but I think it's still supposed to rain some more this weekend. I'm going to go upstairs and clean up my beauty room a bit. I have things that are scattered. I have to get some posts ready for next week. Um, I gotta go wash my face because it feels really greasy. Um, so yeah, I eventually will give a complete tour of my beauty room, um, but that probably won't be for at least another month because I'm getting some little compartment things from the container store and I'm having my mom pick them up from the store um, since she has one that's like 15 minutes away and the one that's by me is two hours away and my brother is coming in three weeks well like two and a half now and I'm so excited and so you might see him in a vlog I don't know but he's going to be bringing stuff down for me so by then I should have everything organized in my beauty room and I can give you a proper tour. But what I need from you guys is if you have watched some of my previous beauty videos, let me know what kind of videos you want to see. Um, I don't necessarily do a lot of tutorials, but now that I've gotten into doing my makeup every day and kind of playing around with it, if you saw something that you liked and want me to do a tutorial for, I can certainly try, but I am definitely in no way any sort of professional or makeup artist or whatever. Um, so what you see from me is what you get. Like you see somebody that plays around with makeup that doesn't have a lot of tools, but can still achieve you know, the kind of look that I want with the stuff that I have. Everything that I have is very affordable. Everything that I have, you know, you can get from the store. Um, and, and I kind of think that is more realistic. Like, not everybody has the ability to go out and get all these makeup palettes. Not everybody, not every blogger or vlogger is sent stuff, you know. So the stuff that I do have, I've bought myself or I've been lucky enough to win from contests. So keep that in mind when you are requesting videos or wanting to see stuff. If you want just opinion videos, let me know. If you want to know my favorite stuff, let me know. Um, but I really want to get the most out of my beauty room and I want to set up my new lights. Um, so yeah, just keep me posted, let me know, and I will try my best to give you guys what you want. So I'm gonna go upstairs and throw this on the computer and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.